Hi, I'm Brian from Certainteed Ceilings. In this series of installation videos, I'll show you how to plan, lay out, and install your Certainteed suspension system and ceiling panels. Step one, drawing your room. The first step to install your Certainteed ceiling system is to calculate the materials and lay out the room. Measure the length of each wall and draw the room on a graph paper. Use one square per foot and draw the room to scale. Once the room is drawn on paper, draw the direction of the floor joists. This can be done by simply drawing a line with two arrows. Step two, locating the main tees. You will want to have your main tees installed perpendicular to the floor joist. To figure out the spacing and location of the main tees, first take the width of the room, in this case, 13 foot, eight inches and divide by the length of the panel. In this example, we are installing two foot by two foot panels, so the length and the width are both two feet. The result will be the number of full panels across the width of the room plus a remainder. Divide the remainder by two, and you have your borders balanced. Next, take your graph paper and count over and draw a line. This will represent your first main tee. Count over four more spaces and draw another line. Continue this until you have reached the other side of the room. You have now drawn all of your main tees. Step three, locating your cross tees. Take the length of the room, in this case, 11 foot, one and a half inches. Follow the same steps outlined to locate the main tees. Divide the remainder by two. And you have your borders of one foot, six and three quarters. This makes your border panels balanced. Count up or down and draw a line. Continue this until you have reached the equal location on the other side of the room. You now have drawn all of your four foot cross T locations. Now that you have completed your four foot cross tee locations, draw a line at the midpoint of each four foot cross tee perpendicularly. This locates your two foot cross tees. You are now ready for your final calculations. Step four, material calculation and fixture location. Using the room diagram that you created, determine the number of pieces of wall angle, main tees, cross tees, and ceiling panels you'll need to finish the project. Main tees come in 12 foot lengths. Cross tees come in two foot and four foot lengths. Two foot cross tees are required to install two foot by two foot ceiling panels only. Wall angle comes in 12 foot lengths. For the ceiling panels, the number of panels and square footage per carton vary between products. So be sure to check the packaging to ensure that you will have enough product to complete the job. You will also need one hanger wire and hanger wire hook for every four feet of main tee. If installing fixtures, choose one that will either fit into the grid system or can be attached to the grid system. If you're using a fluorescent fixture that will sit into the grid, you must consider how much the ceiling will need to drop to accommodate the fixture. If you're going to use a pot light, ensure that you read and follow the directions for supporting the fixture. This concludes the planning and room layout video. Please watch our next installment, which will show you how to lay out your CertainTeed ceilings grid system.